the treatment portion comes when it comes to my books and that is that you need to understand about your B vitamins because you're supposed to be making them in the gut microbiome, but glyphosate, wouldn't you know, kills your ability to make those B vitamins and they're critical for the production of energy everywhere in your body in the mitochondria, the mitochondria powerhouse of the cell. Yeah. And that's why I created the cartoon character, Marty Mitochondria that you see behind me. That's him right there. It's got a little lightning bolt that represents the inner mitochondrial membrane. They were talking about being fat. They were talking about a fat neck and they were saying this fat neck is crushing on you. This is your fault. You're terrible. How dare you get fat? But they weren't seeing the 23 year old petite female patients that I was seeing with terrible apnea. They weren't seeing the men who were working long hours at the office who were hitting 42, 45 fit guys working out at the gym with terrible apnea. That wasn't out there. And instead, the dentists of my community and all around North America, they want to do surgery. They want to do surgery on kids. They want to do all these drastic measures. They want to put CPAPs on kids. And what they don't know and what, you know, is still not known is that it's a simple vitamin D3, vitamin K2 deficiency that's at the root cause of this. So to all those who've had surgery in their jaws, some people needed it. Some people had tiny jaws. Why? Low vitamin D3 and vitamin K2 in their youth. But if you're an adult who wears a CPAP, has sleep apnea, you don't monitor your vitamin D level, you definitely want to check out some of my stuff because I will get people who come to me who wear CPAPs and they say, I'm wearing my CPAP, but I still can't sleep. And those are the people that need the vitamin D supplementation so profoundly. Their lives change because they're already doing the work. They're already wearing a CPAP every night, which is hard. But until their vitamin D level comes up, they do not have success with sleep. At the age of 48, everything changed, and I've been still working at getting healthy. Um, I have reduced my sleep apnea score, my AHI, apnea hypopnea index, from a 22 down to about a 5 or a 4. And I don't wear a CPAP, and I don't wear an oral device anymore, okay? And the reason is I've reversed my apnea because I figured out what the root cause is. I don't sleep perfectly because I have to be careful. You have to worry about the light in your eyes, blocking your blue, blue light at night, all the things that have changed for us humans in our environment. But I try and, you know, I, I never have my phones always on airplane mode, have a, a red uh, old digital alarm clock. You don't want to look at your phone in the middle of the night. Whatever you can do to get the best night's sleep, do it. And that does include putting the things in your nose and taping your mouth, do it. Anything that helps air get in is an absolute benefit. But keep in mind that I will see people who dose their, their B vitamins properly have a great reduction in, in their apnea. DoctorsToTrust.com. Please share this video with loved ones.